Duncan, from the moment I met you when I arrived at Falconers as your new housemate, I knew there was something special about you. It was your caring nature and thoughtful gestures that fast began to break down the wall I had created and I'm forever grateful for your patience in letting me open up my heart to you. Duncan, you inspire me with your profound intelligence and ability to remember everything, especially random trivia. You encourage me by recognising the value I have to offer in this world and you, have, you captured my heart through your ability to communicate kindness, honesty and trust. I love how you make me laugh at the smallest of things, challenge me, pull me back, in, pull me back to earth when my thoughts drift and are the ultimate teammate to whatever we find ourselves doing. As I become your wife today, I make these vows to you. I promise to trust your leadership and to support you in your goals and dreams. I promise that no matter what ups and downs life throws at us, that we will conquer them together and I will always be there by your side. I promise to always show you love along with loyalty and respect in the way that you have shown it to me, deeply and unconditionally. As I enjoy this present moment, I can't help but be excited for our future together. Thank you for loving me and letting me know what true love feels like. I choose to make this lifelong commitment to you today. My best friend, as I know wherever life will take us, with you, it will always make me feel, always feel like home. Thank you for choosing me to be your wife and life partner and the one you love now and forever. Here's to a lifetime full of love, health and happiness. I love you. Halfway I hope from the moment we shared our first kiss that one day you would become my wife and here we are. I love how your positive energy and smile can brighten up anyone's day and your ability to get along with any, everyone is truly second to none. You inspire me to be a better and more understanding person. Our relationship to date has been so easy and relaxed as we share a very similar train of thought. On top of that connection, our sense of humour, which is weirdly similar, has us thinking, imagine if other people were around, they'd probably lock us up. <laughs> Perfectly weighted on a thin piece of paper. I promise to continue to make you laugh at every possible opportunity. I promise to be there for you during all life's moments, the ones that will bring us tears and the ones that will bring us joy. I promise to be loyal, respectful and honest but not too honest, as sometimes that can get me in trouble. <laughs> I look forward to our future together, making this house of ours a home. I promise to love you, to be your best friend, to be patient with you, and to support you with whatever the future has for us. I never knew quite where I was, and suddenly you told me me. He rang me up and wanted to just come and chat to me about something. 
half suspected what Duncan was coming to talk to me about. Well, after walking around my new tractor in Booms Bay, about four or five times, kicking the tyres and commenting how good the tractor was around, and he was beating around the bush a bit. But then he just said, I won't beat around the bush. I'd like to ask Holly to marry me. My response was, do you know what you're doing? <laughs> he nodded me, nodded at me, yes. children, you have visions of them eventually finding a partner and settling down. But the partner they choose is, is their decision and you can only hope they find somebody that cares about them as much as what you do. Well Holly, I think you've nailed it. We couldn't have asked for a better husband for you. Duncan is so suited to you, not only once, but in so many ways, we couldn't be happier. I would like to wish you both an amazing life together and just keep enjoying the things that got you together in the first place and you'll be happy forever. Um, love you both. Mad love, we got that sad love, we got that fun love, we got that young love, yeah, that dumb love, we got that mad I'm sure Duncan has told most of you he was meant to be the next Kobe Bryant. <laughs> His big career started in our court, Passport Stadium. Although he peaked when he was only 12, he still tells everyone as you drive past, they have him framed on the wall. The four of us, Woody here included, would religiously meet every Wednesday night for Sydney night at the Lucendale pub. There we would debrief the weekend, plan for the next, making sure to cover all important topics, farming, footy and females. Sydney nights continue there for a few years, along with a few trips to Adelaide and the odd country races. Fond memories for all of us. But that all changed when Duncan's first and only housemate arrived. Looking at where we are today, maybe it was part of Gratzi's plan all along. Two athletes under one roof. Who knows how many MVPs they'll have. He can be tenacious, relentless, unwavering once he knows what he wants. He's Duncan passionate, but he's honest as they come and loyal to his word. When Duck tells you he'll do something, he'll do it. When he tells you he'll be there, he'll be there. These things, in part, make you the man you are, and that in itself is why you haven't got yourself a key, my boy. I'll be doing that. <laughs> Holly, Duncan, I wish you all the best for what the future holds. May your years be full of happiness and health. Everyone, let's raise a glass and celebrate the beginning of the Ogilvies. We all know it's not easy when young couples are getting together, having to navigate their ways through their partners and extended families weird ways. But I think Holly got it pretty easy. We were happy and excited that Duncan had met Holly and that she was going to become a part of our family. Welcome to the family, Holly. We hope you and Duncan have a long and happy life together. To Duncan and Holly.
know my words. Big hearted, caring, generous, beautiful, whilst also being strong, responsible, courageous. Just a few words to describe Holly Oakley. Wasn't true. Holly, I can't thank you enough for being the best role model, someone who I'm extremely grateful for and my best friend for life. But I'm honestly so proud to call you my sister and proud of the determined, resilient person you've become. I'm moving on. So the saying goes, you can't choose your family, but you can choose your friends. Well, Holly, I beg to differ as I got to choose you as my sister and what a fabulous choice I made. It's not only love, but also being best friends that make for a great marriage. Holly and Duncan, you're not only hopelessly in love, but you're also each other's best mate. A fabulous foundation for a ripper time ahead. Love has been silly together. May your marriage be filled with love, laughter, happiness and good health and being just a bit silly. The landscape changes around me, on and on I feel I must. Whatever happened to me, happened for my highest good. I read that in so many books, now it's almost understood. Like most things, Holly always, is always up for a good time and she embraced this new lifestyle. By the end of second year, both Holly and I had an intolerance to beer and we knew where all the good pub specials were. I believe everything happens for a reason. I believe we are meant to bump into each other at uni, help each other graduate and become lifelong friends. As we are all aware, Holly excels in everything she does. Everything she puts her mind to, she does at 300%. She's a doer, the type of person you want on your team and in your community. You bring out the best in each other, you challenge and support each other, encourage each other's dreams and celebrate your wins. And as a friend to you both, and quite often a third wheeler, I can't help but feel authentically happy in the presence of a couple. Sweet is my location, sweet as well my destination. If you're looking to begin, then look no further than within. I'm satisfied with what I've got and still eager for more. The change that you've been looking for. Duncan. We have loved getting to know you. We cherish you. Thank you for making our girl so happy. Duncan and Holly, you are so perfect for each other and it is so obvious that you are meant to be. We are beyond excited to watch the next chapter of your lives unfold together as Mr. and Mrs. Ogilvy. To Mr. and Mrs. Ogilvy. <laughs>